Hi everyone, it's Charles at Empress Mills and I'm delighted to be here with a brand new fabric collection from Tilda. It only arrived in today called Pie in the Sky. Um, it is brand new. If you follow Tilda at all, you will know that they bring out very few collections a year. So it's always quite exciting when a new range uh, lands with us. And this one certainly doesn't disappoint. It is their um, spring summer collection. There are 20 designs in the range. Usually when Tilda bring a collection out, there are 20 um, designs in the main range. And then they also bring out a separate um, coordinating blender range designed specifically for it, which is what they've done with this. It is called Cloud Pie, just so you can have a little bit of a closer look at the design there. It's got a floral background, which works very well with the um, main florals in the uh, main collection itself, in the um, Pie in the Sky collection itself. So as I say, that's just a separate little blender range just to consider. But Pie in the Sky, um, 20 designs, uh, five prints in four main colourways is what Tilda have created with um, this collection. There are all sorts of little bundles available, all created or curated, should I say, by Tilda themselves. So they work perfectly together. There's the main bundles, we've got a Fat 8, we've got the Charm Packs, we've got all sorts. Um, have a look on the website for all that. You, you, you can find it on there. That's not particularly what I'm here to show you. I wanted to show you the designs themselves, just so you get a bit of a feel for the different prints. So I thought we'd take a look at the uh, five main designs together. Um, the designers themselves, so I'm not insulting anyone when I say this, the designers themselves um, have described the range as having a doodle-like quality. So it's not bang on true to life, but it's got this sort of effortless uh, doodle-like quality to it. In fact, I think that is their exact word, in effort, effortless doodle-like quality um, to it. Much more, in my opinion, now this has been a little bit of a debate here at Empress. In my opinion, um, the shades are slightly more vibrant than we used to from Tilda. Um, we're sort of used to the uh, pastel shades and slightly lighter colours from Tilda. To my way of thinking, they've got a slight more depth um, to them, a little bit more richness and vibrancy to them um, compared to a standard standard Tilda range. But they are wonderful. I am a big fan personally of these. I love the um, I, I love richer colours personally. And um, so that what's that one called? That one is Tazzle Flower. And as I say, it's available in four colours. This one is Whimsy Bird. Plum, which comes with this gorgeous sort of plum aubergine style colour, but it's super rich in its sort of grounding. But they are they are sort of natural rich tones always. It's very difficult to describe. I'm sure you can see it though. Um, hopefully that is helping a lot to be able to see it and you pick up on the design itself. So there's that one, and then we've also got Topsy Turvy is this one and again Tilda themselves have written that they wanted to reflect the um, whimsical effortless nature of the doodle designs in the fabric names themselves which is why we've got these sort of topsy-turvy what was the other one whimsy bird you know we're picking up on their design style even right through into the names Tilda do take um, their brand ethos. I want to say seriously, but serious is the wrong word for Tilda. They do, they do take it to heart. They really sort of um, imbued it into every um, sort of element of the of, of the process. Even as I say, down to the um, down to the naming of the uh, of the fabrics themselves. It's uh, it's it's good. It's good. It's uh, it's it's nice to see from a design company. Um, if you're wondering where they get the actual main name range from, Pie in the Sky. Um, I'm a bit of a geek, I find this kind of thing interesting, so I jotted it down. Um, and it was because the designer wanted to reflect their daydreaming. And I found their little book on it. And they wrote, it is, uh, the collection is a sweet and colourful nod to children like me who struggle with dyslexia and cope by creating alternative, creative worlds full of ideas. Hence the collection name, Pie in the Sky. Um, I don't know, to me, I find things like that super interesting. I think it's really nice. 
to know what the designers had in mind when they were putting the ranges together because personally it always blows my mind um, how a collection comes together how they make colors work um, I do I'm always I'm always amazed um, so we'll just take a look at this final main print so that one is oh sorry it's not not quite the final one that's the this is the fourth one this is confetti and it's picking up in the background of confetti it's really picking up this sort of floral uh, leaf design um, in the background which translates directly over into the um, pie in the sky blenders that coordinate perfectly with the main ranges um, that is my favorite personally that and the other um, that and the other one the uh, whimsy bird is another one of my personal faves uh, let me know what your favorite is i would love to know um, but yes so there's that one and then lastly there is this which has a plain background to it it's reflecting the ochre from that first design that we looked at together and you've got this selection of florals on there but it is another absolutely gorgeous uh, print there that they've created now similar to um lewis and irene and of course many other fabric companies but but particularly those two who are uh, who we are big fans of tilda and lewis and irene um and wilmington and kaufman and, and some of the other sort of real big names in quilting these top brands tend to work with absolutely superb quality uh, base fabric as always with these tildes it is 100 percent cotton um, and it's very smooth which ensures that the print quality is pristine so the designs are translating absolutely perfectly onto the fabric and of course the wonderful fabric is nice to touch and uh, wash as well it can be used for absolutely all sorts if you head on to the if you head onto our instagram page in fact i was going to say onto the website but um hit, click the link underneath the video it'll take you through to a page we've got lots of uh, different images on giving you just a selection of ideas of what you can make using all of these different designs um, from the range whether you want to just cherry pick a few or whether you want to look at more um, uh, projects looking at more of the full range so there we go um, we've taken a look at the five main designs there from the range as I said earlier they are available in the different colorways have a look on the website for those um, and of course get in touch if you have any questions at all um, you can message us through any of the social media channels or of course email through the website or there's a phone number on there don't hesitate to give us a call and either me or one of our wonderful team will be very pleased to help um, I should just mention very quickly before we go we've got the fabric covered buttons uh, created with the fabrics from the range they are perfect for practical use use them as buttons um, on the pro on different projects or they are fantastic for adding a just decorative finishing touch to your um tilda projects or any other projects of course uh, i'll give up to try and stand those up um yes so i hope that's been of use thank you very much indeed for watching as always um and i hope to see you again soon bye bye